Solve the following differential equation, 4x plus 2y squared dx plus 4xy dy equal to 0. So, atong first button is you have to check if pwede ba siya ma-variable si parable. So, by mata-mata class, we can say na no, dili siya pwede i-variable si parable. Tama? So, ang next method nato is to check if homogeneous differential equation ba siya. So, by mata-mata, dili nato siya ma-check class. So, ang kailangan nato bahaton, di ba, is we have to let x equal to vx and y equal to vy. So, this is your original equation. So, substitute nato ang x equal to vx and y equal to vy, ha? So, x ni mo equal to vx, y ni mo equal to vy, uh, x equal to vx, and y equal to vy. Okay? Then, simplify class. So, you have 4x plus 2v squared y squared dx plus 4v squared, so v times v, xy dy equal to 0. Now, factor out nato ang ma-factor out. Um, si v, so you have v times 4x plus 2vy squared dx plus 4vxy dy equal to 0. So, so as you can see, class ka ni siya, atong nakuha diri ah, is not equal to this one. Diba? So, therefore, you can say that this is not a homogeneous DE. Okay, makaingon lang kag homogeneous DE siya if after na to siya na simplify and na factor out, kung kani siya, kung kana siya itong nakuha is mag-equal siya sa original equation na to, then mo na siya ang time na homogeneous DE siya. Pero in this case, wala man. So, no, it is not a homogeneous differential equation. So, ang next step na to, if dili siya variable sa parable, if dili siya homogeneous DE, our next approach is katong exact differential equation. So, exact differential equation, magamit lang ni mo na siya if ang given sa problem is in this form. m dx plus n dy equal to 0. So, in this case, class, kung inyohang i-check ang inyohang equation, this is m dx, tama? And this is your n dy. So, definitely, kaning ato ang given na equation is in this form man, tama? So, therefore, we can use exact DE in this problem. So, to confirm if this is an exact DE, you have to check for the exactness. So, how do we check for the exactness? Okay? So, to check for the exactness, the partial derivative of M with respect to Y must be equal to the partial derivative of N with respect to X. So, sige. So, let's get partial derivative of M with respect to Y. So, diba you have 4X plus 2Y squared. So, itong bahatan diri ah, with respect to y man ka, meaning to say, you have to treat y as your variable and x as your constant. Again ha, you have to treat y as your variable and x as a constant. So, in this case, for x, that's 0, kay constant na sila, plus y is a variable, so that's 4y. Therefore, the partial derivative of m with respect to y is equal to 4y. Okay? Next is, Partial derivative of n with respect to x. So, you have 4xy. So, since with respect to x ta class, meaning to say, uh, you have to treat x as your variable and your y as your constant. Again, ha? You have to treat x as your variable and y as your constant. So, in this case class, the partial derivative of n with respect to x is equal to what? It's equal to 4y. Okay? So, therefore, 4y is equal to 4y. Equal silang duha. Therefore, we can say that this equation and is an exact differential equation class. Okay? So, if na-confirm na nato na yes, exact DE siya. So, proceed ta sa proper solution nato. So, kapag na-confirm na class, then you can now integrate m and n. Okay? So, integrating m dx. So, kani siya integrate nato class. So, which is kani. So, integrate lang class. Ah, uh, okay. So, this is the integral of that. So, in this case, naka-dx ka. So, you have to treat x as your constant. So, 4x. So, that's 4x squared over 2. So, power rule lang ka. Tama? Tapos, kani class 2y squared. So, the integral of 2y squared dx. So, meaning to say, si x ang imuhang variable. So, you have to treat y as a constant. So, that's what? 2y squared x. Or in this case, 2xy squared. Diba? Kay kaniman is a constant lang man. Kung bagay na, ba? Okay, so this is a constant. 
sex. Okay, so I hope na gets lang to siya ka. So dili lang mo ma-confuse ha just because naakay do ka variable dira. Ha. Okay, so sige, next is you have to integrate Ah, sige, so gisimplify pa dahil siya class, so you have 2x squared plus 2xy squared. Okay, then, next is, is to integrate your n, so integral of n dy na kaklas, so kanin siya, integrate nyo na siya, muna siya. Okay, so naka dy ka, naka dy ka meaning to say you have to treat y as your variable and your x as a constant. So, in that case, class, inanin siya. Okay, so 4x constant. Tapos kani power formula, so y squared over 2, which is kani. Then, simplify lang class, you have 2x squared, ay, di, 2xy squared. Okay. okay? So, as you can see, di ba, kani siya, and kani siya nagbalik. Di ba, nag-repeat sila duha na terms. So, if nag-repeat kani ng duha, meaning to say, kapag exact di, tapos inyong pagka-solve karon sa pag-integrate is na yung nag-repeat na terms. Meaning to say, kambaga, you are on the right track. So, maraghayag ang iyong solution class. Okay, so, the last step is to combine the equations. So, it lang. Itong erase ang mga sulat. So, the last step is to combine the equations. So, you have 2x squared, kani siya, plus 2xy squared. So, kani siya, o kana siya. Delete na nimo siya, eh. 2x squared plus 2xy squared plus 2xy squared is equal to C. Delete na na, ha? Kung nag-repeat siya, ikasahon lang ninyo siya o combine dere ah. Again, haka itong mga repeating terms, dere og dere. Ikaisahon lang ninyo siya combine sa final answer ninyo. So, you have 2x squared plus 2xy squared equal to C. Okay, so this is your final answer. So, ina to lang ang imuhang exact DE. So, sa next video is, itry na to siya confirm atong answer using calculator technique. Of course, atong bahaton sa board exam is Caltech man. Then, after that is, let's try to solve another problem for exact DE. Okay, so next video class.